so this video is about me telling you of the things I've learned in my first year of university I hope you you learn something from here if not enjoy number one first years don't have a say by that I mean if you're a first year you're basically a form one you're joining uni for the first time for years they know everything there they know what to do or not to do now you're a first year you don't you you're confused you're a form one you don't know anything first of all kupata the timetable to ya the lessons you're supposed to have is hectic the first three months of being a first year because you have to look for your friends you have to look and you can't go to the department you don't even know where it is fortunately for us we did it online we started our nini uh, classes online because of covid so it was much easier because you could not do a number either class rep i'm a teacher when you as a leader come and i do anything about your unit so yeah, it was easier since online it was better because we didn't physically for me it was easy for me to get my timetables and know where classes are scheduled how to maneuver around the school because to quite not communicate kwa whatsapp group as an imagine when you're making a side first year they don't have those things right now like what work all, all that into online things so by the time we're at a timetable what do class venue you have to contact after class venue jikwat is big any nilikuwa nazunguka yo shule nikitafuta venue kumbe nimezunguka tu hapo and then you can't ask anyone cuz most of the people are kana kudanganya na kwambia oh it's this i don't know why people used to lie why do people lie on such pretty things why anyway and kwambia it's a, a building that we mostly use is called spa so you ask someone where spa is and i could point your left kumbe spa ko right now you go to the left no by the time we rudi huku it's far class maybe ishaanza leka mefika wako katikati topic kujashika hata ujui ni unit gani as in too much sometimes when after class late juu mashine umezunguka shule umepotea you don't know shit eh number 2 is that you will get hit on by lecturers yes that is not a me kukati wana lecturers is a thing by the way so ukifika uni and i mean it's basic science for people to be attracted to i mean see they are also human so no ko uni me actually i didn't find it problematic cuz uko of legal age and if you also want that relationship you can join so yeah but the downside of being hit on by teachers is that anakuja kukufunza alafu later anakukatia na hakufunzi hiyo unit na hujaelewa you get <laughs> like it's like atas juu anakuka it's weird cuz always she ndo mwana like class akikufunza like, alafu comment yako <laughs> unakumbuka vitu mko mnafanya i mean it's just problematic and then and then most of the girls mostly they sleep with lecturers for grades and ndio wapate pass kitu kama hiyo so yeah, that's true most lecturers take advantage of girls if let's say uli miss cut and you go to talk to the lecturer and mwambie oh i was not in school that day so i missed my cut could you please give me a makeup cut or something some of the lecturers will take your advantage of like hmm you need to do something for me first before i give you your cut so ndio mtu graduate sometimes kuna madem wanaonanga it's okay for them to sleep with them but then pia if you think about it from a different perspective what will you do else if they don't want to help you and it's a matter of you graduating or not like it's just too much it's too much number 3 is that you cannot study around your friends <laughs> if you made enough friends that you keep constantly meeting like mnona na every now and then it's hard to study with that friend groups ju mmezoeana na mkiona na mkisoma it's like mm sielewi nini unasema in that side but twende tukule food uko ninaelewa so it's hard to get your friends to 
sit down na msome ile ukweli kusoma cuz mko na a lot of jokes in your head like umeshinda mkijoka around the whole day could turn down your joking to studying but something that you can do so that you can be able to nini to learn with your friends is make your make your studying interesting like to me I've to come uh, examples of life mkiongea mkifikia tu story natumia examples of life ku interact na some topics vitu kama hizo another reason why you can study with your friends is because most of the time watu ushinda wanalewa so by the time mfikiri ati oh twende tu some it's in university it's either you hang together to drink to eat and just to play jokes or you hang together to study research and do all those useful things of which this group b a very rare uwezi pata mtu at wako like a group of maybe six people at them wao ni wakusoma wako tu pamoja ni kusoma yes ni kusoma peke it's rare unless you find one person mwenye wasoma anga peke yake or two people but a group most people wana fikiria anga tu vitu kama twende tu to have fun like when you free you just want to have fun utaki kusumbuka na kusoma roho umetoka high school umeshinda umesoma for years na preps every number four, looking for food is hard in university looking for food is hard as a first year kwanza you don't know which places are worth it like kujui food gani ni poa kwanza if you have a sensitive body kujui utakula wapi So by the time you start sampling every hotel there before you decide which one you want to nini utako ume use a lot of time but ku shorten your stress unaweza tafuta upper level students kama third year fourth year wakuonyeshe joints zao uache kungangana and then pia about food food is cheap in university food is cheap actually it's it's cheap compared to you know when you live tumesa Nairobi wezi pata tu bandaski za kukusaidia like kula chapo either at 10 na dengu ya 30 you get it's like you go, when you go to university it's like you're going to the ghetto <laughs> you get cheaper things cuz your students so they understand you have to buy your own things pole pole yeah the things are cheap in terms of food but the other facilities they're not cheap because they understand you have to buy them on option but kwa food wana joko na option number six, another one is see you know every, everywhere in there's a authority so leaders who are university they don't give a shit about you actually they 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 are like they don't exist because una expect mtu atoke high school and uni akuwe leader anze kukufuatilia tuseme let's say kama class rep kwa class rep yes it's okay but hawatashinda wanakufuatilia ati oh haujapata assignment let me help you oh ati hauku your school email is not working let me help you they won't help you imagine school leadership is not for helping you it's for the leaders to help the lecturers actually it's not for the leaders to help the students <laughs> so yeah it's kind of hectic to deal with akina school reps cuz pia wana try to juggle their own school life how to talk to lecturers and inform them of everything that they need to know na pia wana for lete students your information so leaders for sure they don't really take much weight on to been pointing what the students need but yeah of which it's okay cuz i mean uko uni unafaa uji shughulikie wache ku sumbuana na watu wenye sio wenu 7 or 6 number 6 is you see vile high school kulikuwa na mafankis mnaenda mnajibamba kila mtu anataka kwenda in uni sasa kuna fankis but people don't even attend people don't have that hype anymore unless waski on a poor food or, <laughs> or a snack do attend so is the events most people don't even attend them cuz one the topics they talk about are not things that teenagers or university students want to hear au nataka kusikia vitu kama za pombe bangi ni ningine vitu tu za kuhafana nataka kusikia vitu kama za mental health 
sijui technological change mshuka <laughs> paizo ndio zime kwanga talks of which students don't even attend them because i want the importance of them learning about their mental health au heri wa skie blazer na kuja waenda skize ngoma kwa hall instead of going to the hall to listen to mental health issues yeah so these events as an anger i think should be enough for a change no you change wordings zenye wanatumia kwa advertise events anyway ingine being a first year una kwa easily conned by people since i drew those places unaweza endo ulize mse kwanza kutafuta nyumba kutafuta nyumba is so hard cuz au juu hata uanze wapi kila mtu ako like cuz everyone you know ni first year nao pia wanangana kutafuta nyumba sasa msaidiani yote mko stranded na uweze anza kutafuta stranger ati oh i need a house as in it's a matter of trust which is so hard to give away by the time upate nyumba and it's secure and it has everything you are not conned na fatu should be happy being a first year not easy as being a form one being a first year uko peke yako in this world na lazima ungangane peke yako you don't have anything else to do so yeah that is the video uh next time i think i'll talk about something else other than being a first year so yeah. adios